Hey everyone, Casey Kidson with Defying Dystonia. Myself and my friend Kyla are gonna take you through some stretches today. We're gonna help to increase a little bit of flexibility, range of motion. So grab a yoga mat or a towel, find a comfortable position and come relax with us as we take you through your stretches. Half stretch for 30 seconds. Sitting up nice and tall, you're gonna extend one leg out nice and long, drawing your opposite leg in towards your inner thigh, reaching out for the leg that's extended. You wanna focus on feeling this stretch in the back of the leg in your calf. Switch sides. Glute and hip stretch. Sitting up nice and tall, extend your left leg. Draw your right leg in towards the body. You can choose to cross your leg over and follow Kyla for a little deeper stretch. Planting your right hand behind you, hug in towards your right leg. Get a nice stretch in through the hip and glute. Switch sides. Cat cow, giving your lower back and back a nice release. We're gonna place our hands under our wrists and in line with our shoulders, knees under hip, coming in to a tabletop position. As you inhale, round your back for cat, and as you exhale nice and slowly, come into cow, slightly drawing your stomach down towards the mat and shifting your neck forward. Torso rotations. Slowly guiding your body in a circle, bending forward at the hips and slowly rotating around. Switch directions to maintain that balance on each side. Neck stretches. Slowly dropping your chin towards your chest just until you get a nice comfortable stretch. Shifting now to the right side, drawing your ear towards your shoulder, slightly guide your neck to the right. We'll switch to the left, slowly guiding your left ear towards your left shoulder and pausing. Just working to a range that works for you. You know your body best, so this may be a very small movement for you, and that's perfectly fine. Squat with deep breath. 
Placing your feet on the ground, take a nice deep inhale and slowly lower into a light squat, guiding your arms in front of you. As you rise, take a nice deep exhale, guiding the arms around, pausing for a nice shoulder roll. As you move down, slowly bring your arms down with you. And as you rise, circle them above your head. Again, if you don't have that range of motion, you can keep your arm movements smaller and keep them more closer to the body. Thank you so much for moving with us today. Be sure to check out our other exercise videos dedicated to those with dystonia. We'll see you again soon.